Saving Salila's Turtle, an Environmental Engineering Story. Chapter 2, Pollution Problems. You're soaked, my mother cried, standing in the doorway. Don't track that mud through the house. Mother, it was horrible, I said, as she started to rub my wet hair with a towel. On the way home from school, we found a cachua in the Ganges. The water was oily and dirty. I know it's going to t- make the turtle sick. I have to rescue the turtle. And what about the other animals living in the water? I need to make the Ganges safe for them. Okay, Salila, mother said. Take a deep breath. We'll figure out a way for you to help your turtle in the river. I knew my mother would be able to help. She knows a lot about the water in our country because she's an environmental engineer. She uses her knowledge of science and math and her creativity to help make the air, water, and soil in the environment cleaner and safer. Problems like these are exactly why I became an environmental engineer, said Mother. India is a country surrounded by water, and we have many rivers, yet there are still people who don't have access to clean water. We think of the Ganges as sacred because the water allows us to live, but we need to keep the Ganges clean in order for her to continue giving life to people and to animals. Father, I said, I knew we should have rescued the Kachua. It is important to help the environment and the animals who live in it, Father said, but what would we have done with the turtle? I could keep the turtle in a tank, a big tank, so it would have plenty of room to crawl and swim. Oh, I know, I said, clapping my hands together. I can clean some water from the Ganges and use it to fill the tank, and then the turtle will feel at home. I just need to remove the trash from the water. Mother and father looked at each other in silence for a few moments. I knew they were thinking about whether I would get to bring home the turtle. That sounds like the beginning of a good plan, Mother said finally. I agree, Father nodded. If you do careful work to make a cleaner habitat for the turtle, then you can keep it as a pet. I can feel butterflies fluttering in my stomach. My own pet. I knew I'd have to do a good job of cleaning the water for the turtle. It is important for you to learn about removing contaminants from the Ganges, Mother added, for the turtle and for the people of India. Tomorrow after school, I'll take you to the university to show you the work some of my colleagues have done to clean the water. Tomorrow, I asked, what should I do to get ready? Well, Mother began, when something is polluted, it means it has been filled, become filled with harmful substances that dirty the environment. You could start by asking some good questions about how the water in the Ganges becomes polluted. Where does the water in the Ganges come from? How do the pollutants get into the water? Father nodded. Come on, Salila, he said. Together, I bet we can answer some of these, those questions.